boom fewer subscribers back again with these quick updates because trust if it's not for if i'm king mix up it's not credible and you don't know the thing said people but they up on the sunday back with the allegations and updates again you know and it's alleged according to my industry insider vibes cartel is the father of skilly bang yes you know the streets have been talking uh the talking have reached my dm and my source said vibes cartel says skilly bang is his child again this is allegedly allegations you feel what i'm saying but people you don't know all my industry insiders work they are very credible if it not go so it got near so you see me i say and for example I know I said I wasn't going to talk about this tree teeth monster with corrosive saliva call it me stinking cigarette breath. But a month ago, we was the first one to tell you that this sandbag body of a thing um, was in the DR getting this item body surgery. You feel what I'm saying? And I update the story um, a few days ago when she got arrested at the airport the airport and i think my headline was w magnum arrested by immigration um face deportation back to jamaica after doing designer body so the reason why we're talking about the governess one because her management um put out a statement yes that confirmed she was in the yard uh, getting the, the body done you feel me and like i said people these Gumless, junk or jojo thinking all people them. I will come with them proof where I this Duffy Magnum before the days I started this in her. Because as you can see, I got many people that watch everything that I did pertaining to this topic and they can't see why she's dissing me. Well, she's dissing me because they need the clout. But nevertheless, listen to this. King Mix Up, even though I wouldn't like say I like your style sometimes, you didn't say anything wrong about her. I thought you were very gentle with her story and showed empathy towards her it's because of you why i post here on my page asking for prayers you feel what i'm saying yeah so like i said people people is looking to hype off for me because i'm the bad guy you feel what i'm saying but i'm the wrong person to look a hype offer because i always got my receipts on everything that i do good and bad so you know, I'm going to go trending again when this gumless tooth girl gets out of, um, you know what, ICE detention center. But nevertheless, let me read you the official statement that her team put out. And I laughed the whole time when I was reading it because I'm saying they just confirmed everything what I said from day one. You feel me? But nevertheless, her management team said, I'm here to put all the speculations to rest regarding toothless monster." rumors about her being held by immigration it would be foolish for us to deny this but what we are not going to do is do the, the add-on speculations okay that's why you were supposed to put the statement out from day one but a close to not look anyway so to clear the air this is an immigration issue not a criminal topic yes people she overstayed her visa basically um so it's not a criminal matter it's a uh immigration um thing there is only one problem and it's regarding her overstaying here in the states i've retained an attorney who goes by the whatever whatever and declare this is only a immigration issue not a criminal case i have spoken to her assistant miss stewart who was there at the time and people may have paraphrase right no you know and the two of them get old but she get to go through and w was placed in the back as soon as she came off of um the sentinel you see me answer and he said that she was in the DR because she was getting a Barbie doll makeover. And this is how you know he's just trying to get his money back. Which part of the gumless monster look like a Barbie? Really and truly, which part of this gumless monster? She look like one of them rascal alien them. You see me, I said. Yeah. So, 
that's why he said that she was over there because it's the makeover, you know what I mean? And that's why he's here too. So at that I go on now, it's a mass of people. The management put out statement as they can read and it confirms what I said. Homegirl was in dot and DR getting her body did and um she get booked at the airport. So I don't really know the the the, the, the laws with the immigration of overstaying. But this is what I found out. I guess if you stay like over 180 days or something like that, or over 181 days, you know, that Nick, you can be finding some penalty thing, you know. So a lot of people said she was in Jamaica the other day in Bahamas in the UK. So like I said, people are speculating that her papers was good then or you know what people was using some things to get her across borders and stuff but we don't know but nevertheless i'm just giving you an update on this oh toothless rascal corrosive saliva um overstate hey welcome you know what i mean that she never want to go back home you don't look like she got no home back in yard you know <laughs> this bitch don't even got no home in fucking america bouncing all over the place but nevertheless people enough about that all right people the part of the review owners waiting for I already proved with the toothless monster that my industry sources are very close to the industry and you don't know the thing set when you're pillow talking. So based off of some pillow talking by from some credible names, it was revealed to my source that Vibes Cartel is the father of Skilly Bang. Now, I don't know too much about Skilly Bang. Um, I know who his mother is, you know, beautiful lady, not trying to make her famous, but you know, I didn't really see nothing with his father, you know what I mean? Um, I know his grandfather was in his life um, tremendously. I think he's from St. Thomas, but you don't know the thing. Islanders move around and a lot of people are saying in the comment section, like, yo, that Skilly Bang's son and all of these things, well... my source i don't want to call my source name and i would never do that but if me called the name that was doing the pillow talking you would definitely believe it you know um the kids look similar but then again i am no specialist so i'm just letting you know that's what the word is being saying um if it does come out officially you heard it here first you know so I'm just giving you that update with the Toothless Monster. Her management team put out an official statement that basically exposed the lady business. You see me answer? And confirmed that I was right. You say it. So don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Because I run you say get the latest in a dance on news, musical views, and gossip. Bless.